Boom, what's going on everyone? Want to do a quick little video update here going through shopping cart. Uh, man, so today wasn't great again. Didn't get my goal accomplished. What I'm trying to do is on the shopping component here, if I click to that, um, adding items to the cart. So all good adding one item at a time like this. If I just go on any product here and click the add to cart button, it'll add it one at a time, but I'm trying to get this quantity thing working. So there's already six items in the car. If I want to add another three more of this jacket here, it should render to nine. It's still going to seven. Um, it's yeah, I'm just having a super hard time getting this, uh, getting this quantity thing working. It's kind of confusing. Um, I got some help earlier and tried to implement it, but man, I could just not get this working. And I don't know. It was just not making sense. It was not making sense. I couldn't get it working. So I decided to uh, come back tomorrow. Try and get it solved. You know, sometimes when you're at this for a long ass period of time, you can start making su stupid mistakes and overthinking shit. I think that's kind of where I'm at right now. Um, yeah, could just be completely exhausted, and um, with some good rest and kind of visualize the outcome, I think I can finally get it solved. So that's kind of what I'm working on here. I won't even bother trying to explain like what I'm doing here, because um, I really have not even tried to implement what this guy tried to help me, uh, that game plan the guy tried to help me out with. I really, I tried to implement it, but I kind of just deleted the code. I won't even bother trying to explain it to you guys. But, um, you know, just an app here. I got all the items in a cart. Um, I'm grabbing the length of the items in the carts. So, you know, when I add items, uh, it will show up in that little badge right there. Um, that's basically that there. And then I pass those the state variables here to these different components, um, which then they get updated and then they get rendered to the header components. That's basically what I got going on there. I, I won't go too into depth explaining it. My brain is honestly just fried, but um, man, I get pissed with this shit sometimes that I can't get it, where I feel like I'm so close to getting it and I want to just get it now and move forward, get on with the project, but damn, kind of like hit like a roadblock here with this, but Get a good night's sleep. I'm going to rest. Be back at it tomorrow. And then the goal by tomorrow, which I know I'll get this tomorrow. I've got plenty of time to get this working out. Is So again, tomorrow's goal. Click on a product here. Select the quantity. If I want four of this jacket and I hit add to cart, boom. It's going to have that four there instead of one. I can add, them, I can add one item. One item fine. But multiple items of different quantities, that's tough. You know, so... Yeah, again, boom. I already have four items in the car, and I want to add five items of this, so it should render nine to the screen. So if that makes sense, that's what I'm working on there, guys. Make another video update to here tomorrow, and I'll be all excited when I finally solve it. Probably won't be easy, but um, just going to do what I can. So until next time, guys, that's about it. Apologize for being uh, freaking pissed here. Let me get this out of here. <laughs> Say a final word here. Apologize for being kind of pissed, kind of on edge. I just get disappointed when I can't meet my coding goal for the day and get this completed but tomorrow's another day guys tomorrow's another day so don't mean don't mean to be down the dumps i just have high expectations i want to get this shit done all right till next time guys keep grinding